Hey, I'm Amanda, this is Millie, and this is Dill. And on today's tutorial, we'll be covering tips and tricks on how to introduce cats. If you're a one cat pet parent who wants to add another kitty to the mix, I've got great news. It's easy to have one big happy cat family with just a little patience and the right intros. Quick note before we begin, to see if your cats are a good match, consider their breeds, size, socialization history, and energy levels. You can also contact your vet or pet behavior specialist with any questions. Step one, gather your supplies. Make sure you have a tall pet gate, towels, treats, and toys for both. You may want to think about having a helper too. They could come in handy. Step two, for now, keep them apart. Give your new cat their own room with access to food, water, litter box, and a scratching pad. Keep the door closed so your other cat can't get in. Step three, start a scent exchange. Rub a towel or blanket all over one cat. Then place it on the floor and sprinkle it with treats for your other cat to explore. Do this three to five days in a row so your cats can start to form a positive association with each other. Step four, let them do some exploration. While keeping them separated through closed doors, allow them to explore each other's spaces for a few hours, or even an entire day. If either cat is uncomfortable and starts to growl or hiss, go back to the previous step. Step five, encourage play through the door. Using a string toy, get one cat to swat it near the door. Then do the same with the other cat. Keep looking for growling, hissing, or hitting with force, and if need be, go back to the previous step. Step six, let them see each other. Open the door and let your cats peer through. You may hear a growl or a hiss when they first see each other. Don't let them have a stare down here. Try diverting their attention with a toy. Step seven, let them interact through the gate. Look for soft eye contact, blinking, and elevated tails, all signs they're feeling friendly. Using two string toys, one for each cat, allow them to play on either side of the gate during this step. There shouldn't be any growling, hissing, or aggression at this point. And if there is, go back to the previous step. Do this for up to two days. And if they stay calm, move on to the next step. Step eight, let them meet face to face. The moment of truth has arrived. Remove the gate and watch them carefully. If they start to stare at each other intently, distract them with noises like loud hand claps. Keep these sessions no longer than 10 minutes, three to five times a day. If one of the cats appear overwhelmed or fearful, cut it short. Step nine, let them stay by themselves. After seven to 10 days of no signs of fear or aggression, it's okay to start leaving your cats home alone for short periods of time. You can have a pet camera to watch how they're behaving while you're away. And if they get along, increase the amount of time they're alone. Eventually, they'll be safe together 24 seven. I'm Amanda, this is Millie, and this is Dill. As always, we want to hear from you. So like this video, drop a comment, and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching.